right direction. Okay. Uh, okay, let's uh, start. This is problem one A, and uh, uh, the uh, problem is a, uh, a presidential candidate claims he can save the space program millions of dollars in life support costs by installing snorkels in all of the spacesuits. He argues that there is a non-zero probability that a gas will compress into half its volume. And part A is, what is this probability for one mole of gas? And so, um, the probability that something is going to be in one side or the other, if we have the, we divide the volume into two sections, is, um, so the probability for Avogadro's number is equal to one half to the n naught. And the, the, the key feature here is that the uh, number of particles occurs in the exponent. Okay? And so that, because one taken to any power is one, so this is equal to um, one over two to the n naught. And so now, in order to put this in, so there's a 1 in 2 to the n naught probability or chance that this is going to occur. But that, uh, most people don't really have a good feel for um, uh, base 2. So we want to uh, express it in base 10. And so the way we handle that is we let um, 10 to the a equal 2 to the n naught, so we can convert this to base 10. And then um, the uh, a is equal to the log of 2 to the n naught. Okay, and that means that uh, I can, because of the rules with exponents, I'm allowed to pull this through the log. And so do that. That's equal to n naught times the log of 2. And so, uh, uh, can anybody tell me what the log of 2 is? Plus 3 and 1. Yeah, okay. So that's equal, so this is equal to n naught times 0 0.301, which is equal to, since n naught is Avogadro's number, 6.022 times 10 to the 23rd times 0 0.301. And that's equal to 1.8 times 10 to the 23rd. And we can finally state that there exists a 1 and 10 to the 1.8 times 10 to the 23rd chance. Okay, now the, the main feature of this is this 1.8 times 10 to the 23rd is in the exponent. So that's how many zeros there are. And this is the, this number is just unimaginably huge. In other words, it's not very likely that a gas is going to compress. And we arbitrarily chose one half the volume. It, 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 it's going to be pretty much the same for just a tiny fraction. To, compress one-tenth of its original volume is going to be something around the same magnitude. It's just stating the likelihood that this is going to occur. Okay? So, everybody has that. Um, I'm going to go ahead.